What are speed squats? So let's talk about this. Basically, I'm trying to get a squat done as quickly as I can, right? Now I'm not very fast, so it probably doesn't look very blurry on the camera, but this training tool helps me develop force and helps me develop power, right? So what is training for? Generally with athletics, it's, it's power focused, right? I have time demands and I need to beat someone to the puck or I need to beat someone to the ball or to the open space or I need to shake someone off, right? All of those things are time dependent. If that person is moving faster in the given time, then I lose. So uh, power-based movements. So these speed squats help me with that. Also, if you're a power lifter, say, you might be doing a lot of low, slow, or low, what am I doing? Slow, just slow. You might be doing a lot of slow movement and, and grinding through reps that are taking maybe a second or two to complete rather than you know a quarter to half a second. Um, and maybe you need to train a different side of your, your muscle structure and of your nervous system, right? Maybe you need to teach that, uh, that nervous system to turn on more quickly. Maybe you need to increase the rate that you develop force. Part of that is a nervous system thing, yes, but part of that is also the shapes of your muscles. So power lifters get really good at grinding through reps and moving slowly, but you know, my traditional background is more powerlifting. I'm pretty slow. I'm very muscular effort based. I don't use my tendons very well. I don't use my stretch shortening cycle very well. Instead, if you look at a basketball player who doesn't really like lifting weights, they come in and they can move really quickly. And every weight you give them looks pretty much the same and it moves at pretty much the same speed. And then all of a sudden they can't do it. Right? So their bodies, their shapes, their musculo tendinous neuro stuff, it doesn't support heavy loads very well. So they might be really good at something like a speed squat where I'm coming down really quickly and I'm coming back up really quickly. They might be able to utilize that stretch shortening cycle, but um, maybe you need to start loading them a little bit more. So, you know, a basketball player is going to be really good at doing it with just body weight, but maybe body weight isn't enough anymore. Maybe they need to put 95 pounds on this bar and move it quickly. Maybe they need to put 200 pounds on this bar and move it quickly, depending on you know how big they are, how strong they are. So food for thought. This is a, a force development thing. It's about moving the weight quickly. So you cannot use the same weight that you use for your maximal effort, your one rep max squats, but it is still effective in increasing those one rep max squats because you're training the body, you're training the tissue system, right? You're training yourself how to go.